Hi guys, this is Go for Agriculture channel. Today we are going to discuss Arun Katyan chapter 12 that is agroforestry and social forestry. Previous lecture we have discussed about the assessment of agronomic interactions. So today we are going to discuss agroforestry. The first question is a system where agriculture and forestry are practiced simultaneously in same unit of land land that is called agroforestry. So agroforestry means a system where both agriculture and forestry are practiced in the same unit of land next one the growing of agriculture crop along with forest crop is called agri silviculture so silvi means tree agri means crops so growing of agriculture crop along with forest crop is called agri silviculture now let us all discuss that what is the necessity of agroforestry first to maintain ecological balance next to act as wind breaks creates employment opportunity and what are the objective of agroforestry these are diversified and uh, more sustainable production economically superior and production of basic needs of farmers these are the objectives of agroforestry now agri silviculture the growing of agriculture crop along with forest crop next one silvo pastoral system what is silvo pastoral system a land system in which forests are managed for production of wood as well as rearing of domesticated animals so silviculture plus pasture management silviculture plus pasture management is equal to silvo pastoral system next one alle cropping perennial hedge plus crops so what is alle cropping alle cropping is a woody species in hedges is grown with agricultural species in rows so in a row management both woody species as well as agriculture species are grown that is called alle cropping next one hill plantation is otherwise called as tongya system so the tongya means hill hill system is called tongya system in tongya system combined stand of woody as well as agriculture species are grown in hills these are the establishment of plantations this is called tongya system next one production of protein rich tree fodder on farm is called protein banks so here the protein rich tree with fodder on farm is planted for fodder production that is called protein banks it is a part of silvo pastoral system next one encouraging farmers to raise trees on their own plot through free supply of seedlings is called farm forestry it is a part of social forestry it is a program which gives the objective of en encouraging farmers to plant and raise tree on their own plot of land through free or subsidized supply of seedlings and they grow around the farm that is called farm forestry next one massive plantation for benefit of community along road fallow and uncultivatable lands is called rural forestry so here rural forestry is for the benefit of community as a whole through massive plantation along we can say roadside canal banks tanks ponds fallow and uncultivatable lands this is called rural forestry now rural forestry is also called extension forestry why because as this result in extending forest beyond the existing boundaries so it is called extension forestry next one forestry in urban areas is called urban forestry so we can say that forest tree that is in urban areas for example on the useless land that is near government building school colleges roadside hospitals and we can say community woodlands are planted by particular communities themselves on land so these are all come under urban forestries now the basic concept of agroforestry is that it is divided into three system agri silvicultural system silvo pastoral agri silvo pastoral first one agri silvicultural system in this improved fallow is that tongya system we have already discussed that is hill cultivation improved fallow system means wood these species are planted and are left to grow during the fallow phase this means that if you are growing a crop after that the land is left for wood these species to grow that is called fallow phase and next we have discussed early cropping next multi layer tree gardens that are 
the multi species dense plants that are grown with arrangements next one that is home gardens home gardens are intimate and combination of various trees and crop around homesteads and wind breaks and shelter belts these are very very important concept in uh, agroforestry these are the trees that are grown around farmland or plots in wind prone areas so that it can stop the wind mildly and we can say next one silvo pastoral system in this we have already discussed protein banks next plantation crops so plantation crops means example cattle under coconuts in uh, southeast asia and south specific so here plantation crop tea coffee are grown next one agri silvo pastoral system in this aqua forestry apiculture with trees multi purpose woodlands so here acro uh, that is we can say apiculture with trees that means trees for honey production next one uh, aqua forestry in this trees lining fish ponds trees leaves being used as forage for fish and multi purpose woodlands these are for various purpose for example wood fodder seed oil production and we can say soil reclamation these are very very important so thanks for watching this video if you want more and more video then subscribe our channel go for agriculture if you want ppt then download from our telegram channel go for agriculture till then stay